Hi guys, I hope you're having a great day. So in this video, I'm gonna finally use these picture frames that I previously mentioned that I purchased at a consignment store for a dollar a piece. They're made out of real wood. They just have some random photos in them, but they are this orangish color. So I'm gonna start by sanding them down and painting them black. I have a family project that we worked on years ago, but I'd like to change them up just a little bit and put them inside these frames. So that's what I'm sharing in this video. Let's get started. So I just used a piece of scrap sandpaper to lightly go over the frame and then wiped them down with a damp paper towel before painting them and it took two coats of paint to get the coverage that I wanted. So I just kept working on all of the frames. In fact, I kind of got ahead of myself and did not sand one of them, but that's okay. The end result, I really can't tell which is which. So hopefully they all hold up just fine, but I'm really excited to finally get this project done. I'm hoping it turns out the way that I'm wanting it to. While the picture frames are drawing, let me show you the artwork that I want to update with these frames. This is something my family did years ago before my son went off to college. I just picked two fun colors that I thought would match our room and then painted everybody's hand black and we placed our handprint onto our own painting. And it was just something fun that we did. We just slapped some paint on some art paper and then put our handprints on them. And I just thought it would be a lot of fun to have this displayed in my bedroom. So I want to change these up because these colors no longer match our room. I'm definitely going to be keeping these, putting them in my keepsake box. I am going to try to scan these in my printer and print them in black and white. And if that works, I'm going to put them in these frames and I think it's going to be really pretty and then it will match the color scheme of our room and just give them a little bit of an update. And these frames are so old and they're kind of falling away from the wall. In fact, some of them have tape holding them together. So I I'm ready to get to this project. So the picture frames are dry, so I'm gonna set those aside and clean all of the glass for the frames and make sure that's good and dry before I put these together. And I'm so happy with how our artwork printed. And I use the term artwork, you know, kind of loosely. I know it's not everybody's cup of tea, but I just love them. It's something that I will treasure forever. We had so much fun doing those, even though they took maybe five minutes to do. We just had a lot of laughs when we made them, and I really enjoy having those on my wall. So I am gonna get these cleaned up and put these together, and we'll take a look. I 
I know I'm gonna have to cut these down a little bit to fit inside their frames so I kept one of the photos that was in the picture frame and I'm gonna use that as my guide to cut them down to size and then we're gonna put these together So I'm loving how these turned out, that neutral updated look that they have and I love the original bright fun pops of color, definitely keeping those, but I'm excited to have this neutral color scheme in my room. Here's another look at the before and the after. I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did please like it, comment to let me know, I'd really appreciate it. I hope you have a wonderful blessed day and thanks for watching.